Howdy, ni hao. Bienvenidos. I'm Shane Battier of the Houston Rockets, and welcome to the next installment of Tech Ed. We've been doing this uh, this this online blog now for uh, over a year, and uh, we've had some, some great products. We've had some duds, uh, but I'm here to help sort through the madness that is technology. I'm I'm like your uh, your technology shaman in a lot of ways. I'm an old school guy and uh, growing up in Detroit, the Motor City, uh, the way that I uh, earned a lot of my money growing up to buy garbage pail kids and, and baseball cards and all that good stuff uh, was by washing cars the old fashioned way, by hand. This, it promises to be a breakthrough in, tech, in the, the, the technology of washing cars, windows, RVs, boats, trailers, whatever you have. And what we have is the Ionic Clean. Uh, it uses the power of ions to wash away the dirt and, and repel um, any grind that you have on your car, your RV, your windows. Um, we'll see. That's a pretty bold claim. It's a pretty, pretty bold claim that I am excited to try out today. The, the guinea pig, the Audi A8, it's a nice car. Um, it was pretty fast, although I don't advocate speeding. As you can see, it is dirty. And so this would be a great test for the Ionic Clean machine. Look at all this dirt. As water flows through the Ionic Clean, positive and negative ionic exchange occurs. This removes minerals and impurities that would normally remain on the surface and cause spots as water dries. We're gonna put that theory to the test and see if you can actually clean your car, clean your windows, clean your RVs, your trucks, your trailers, your four-wheelers, your three-wheelers, without using soap and uh, getting the spotless, clean feeling, the out of the storeroom feeling that you get when you buy a new car. So the first step in using the Ionic Clean uh, as you can see, very simple instructions. You have the off, you have the deionizing water, and the bypass. The first step is just wash your car normally uh, with a brush and water. No soap. Just the brush and the ionic care. Now there is an optional, if you get something really, really uh, dirty, there's an optional uh, soap dispenser you can buy. It needs a light detergent, but they say you don't need it. And I'm getting wet, I'm getting wet. Now where the Ionic Clean, its claim to fame really comes from is the deionized water uh, that is stored in the tank. And by, by flipping the switch from bypass to deionized de water, what it's supposed to do is take off the negative electrons, very scientific, um, from the surface that you're washing. By using the deionized water, it sort of makes the surface neutral and um, it, it is much less apt to um, collect the pollen and all that stuff. So we're going to use the deionized water right now to remove the dirt and the grind. We'll see if it works. Deionizing the car. That's what we're doing now. Deionizing the car. All the negative electrons rinsing away. Here we are, five minutes has passed. Uh, we have waited uh, to let my, my car dry in the sun. Uh, like Ionic Care says, you don't need to, to chamois it off or use a towel. Uh, so sorry, no, no sham wow today. Um, and let's check out the results. The car was fairly dirty from before, but when I when I investigate the windows, one of the things they claim is spot-free windows. Well, there's quite a few water spots. You can't. I don't know if you can pick it up on camera. Uh, but there are quite a few water spots here. Um, that's that's disappointing. Uh, right around this area, it does look actually fairly clean. Uh, but the problem is, I don't know if you can see this, this looks very, very, very dirty. Actually, it looks worse 
now than it did before I actually washed the car. Uh, this is one of my rims. I don't have rims, just factory installed. Uh, but I did, I did go after this with, the, with the, the brush scrubber pretty good. And that looks pretty shiny compared to the other... Compared to the other rim, uh, which looks kind of gross. Um, so, I think there is some merit to the brush and the scrubbing. Um, I just don't know if I'm believing in the Ionic Care technology. For this test, half of the car was done with the Ionic Care, and the other half was left dirty. I don't know if you can pick this up on the internet. Uh, but actually, again, not terrible. If I had to grade this product, uh, I would have to give it a C plus. Um, and so, if I were getting the Ionic Care, I would suggest you get the the additional add-on soap injector attachment um, and when used with the deionized water may have some better results. So this is Shane Battier. Thank you so much for watching today. So for Hoop Magazine, tune in next month to see the, the latest and the greatest and the newest in technology. Adios, amigos.